And welcome back. This is Thorn with Game Design Lexicon. We are currently playing us uh, some Sid Meier's Colonization. I hope everybody's having a wonderful Monday and their 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 week is starting off well. And um, all that kind of jazz, you know. I mean, sometimes you just gotta you just gotta kind of trudge on and and uh, you know colonize the world if you can. Um, where was I? What was I doing? Oh yeah, that's right. I had a whole bunch of people sitting on the docks waiting for my ass. Let's uh, go with the this guy. I need that guy up front. I need this guy up front. And how much money do we have? Not enough for a ship. So let's uh, steady as she goes. I need a ship desperately now. Um, Where are we going to go with this guy? I guess we'll go to this Aztec town here. 3743. Okay. Oh, wait a second. Did I not chart that one down? Oh, no, that's the other guy. Never mind. 3743. I forgot I had two scouts going right now. Okay. So let's take him and head him up that way. Oh, nice. Um, farmers, tools, goods, rum. Farmers, tools, goods, and rum. Get that charted down. Thank you, Mr. Aztecs. Um, what is this guy here? 5131? I already got that one. Okay, yeah. So let's move him to y'all. Uh-oh. Oh, oh. Okay, yeah, sure. Go in peace, French brothers. Um, get bent, all that sort of stuff. So let's uh, go here. Nothing but rumors. Okay, ooh, ore miners. Tools, rum, and cloth. Uh, ore miners. Tools, rum, and cloth. Alright, tools, rum, and cloth? Yes. Okay. So, next turn. I need to get enough for another boat is what I need to do. This uh, this single one that the um that the English start off with is just painful. Thirty-eight forty-six is our next town. Thirty-eight comma forty-six. No, not forty-eight forty-six. There we go. And let's go. Let's see. Ooh, fishermen. Tools, goods, and rum. Fishermen. Tools, goods, and rum. Noise. Okay. Let's go down here. Oh, nice. That'll help me buy that ship that I'm going to need. I need, what, 2,000 for a privateer would be nice, and then I'll have two two places shuffling back and forth. Okay. Nice, nice. So let's, um, what are we going to do here? We need, that's a hill, right? Okay. Scrub forest road. Probably need to plow that over. And then we can get ore miners in here eventually. So let's see. Blacksmith shop, maybe? Do, 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 do. Warehouse expansion would be good. Yeah, let's do blacksmith shop. Probably going to need that more than anything right now. Okay. So, already got that guy. Um, should start to have enough for another town soon. Let's head this way. 3343? 33, 33, 43. And... There we go! Oh, it's up here. Oh, of course. We have to go around that guy. Farmers, tools, goods, and rum. Tools, 
goods and rum. Noise. Okay. Now where else am I gonna go with him? Um Have I gotten this guy yet? What is this guy? 4233? Oh yeah, I've gotten that guy already, so no reason to head that direction. Let's go ahead and map this stuff out though. Zoinks. Sure. Oh my god, that was really loud. Um, Jamestown has run out of lumber, of course. That's okay. Get the lumberjack back down. Okay. So. These guys, I guess, are doing okay. Um. Have I got this? I mapped that guy, right? 38, 38. Oh yeah, got him. So let's head him over here, which is 3338. And boink. Oh, gonna have to go around. Oh nice. So we got our blacksmith, which means we can now take this guy. Let's go ahead and move him outside for now. And then this guy can go in as a blacksmith. We got plenty of food, so we can now have an ore miner. Hell yeah, dude. And let's go ahead and have this guy... Oh shit, actually I'm going to run out of food if I put him in. So I could take him and trade him as an expert fisherman. Maybe I'll do that. Let's uh, take a look here. Fisherman, 3846. Plow City Tile. Yeah, I really should do a... Uh, yeah, I should do a... Uh, I was going to wait until I had enough tools to do a full run, but yeah, you're right. I should, um, I should pioneer him. And put roads and plow. Yeah, let's do that. That'll help the productivity there. Um, and with this guy, let's see what goods we have. Probably not a lot of anything. I guess we'll take the fur, and we'll take the sugar, and let's head back, because we got more people that we need to bring forward. Um, 3338, we marked that one down? Yeah, okay, we did. So, let's explore. got here. We might as well get these guys. Um, Arawak. Nice. 46, 26? 46, comma, 26. And I guess that we'll go to that one next. Okay, with this guy, let's um, plow this area here. Um... Actually, this oasis here. So, wow, oasis 2 plus 4. So, it's probably good to leave that oasis there, right? So, yeah, let's go ahead and plow that one. Then we'll road all the way around. We also need a fisherman there. So... Anybody? Everybody's moved, right? Okay. No, it doesn't say in turn. What the hell are we waiting for? Oh, this guy right here. Okay. Um, plow. What do you mean? Uh, because I control, I can control what gets into the port, and thus the taxation. What do you mean by that? The reason why I usually... So what I do is I kind of do it as a... Since you can have four stops per trade route on, on uh, wagons, what I'll do is I'll web them uh, in groups of three, right? So one, when I get a, another town here, it'll be Jamestown, Plymouth, and that third town, whatever it is. And then I'll cycle everything to Jamestown... And then the same thing with Plymouth. Plymouth will have another two, so it'll it'll work kind of like a tree, right? Plymouth will have two subsidiaries that'll shuffle everything to Plymouth. The one up here will have two that'll shuffle everything to it, and that'll make it all kind of work up the tree. 
until it gets to Jamestown. And then once it gets to Jamestown, I'll have it to where uh, Jamestown will carry uh, unprocessed uh, stuff back down to the towns that produce them. So, and that way I can just have automated routes and have everything go to where it needs to go. And I can have as many wagons as I want doing each route as needed. Okay, oh, Airwac. We are happy to meet our Airwac brothers. Okay, what do we got here? All? Farmers, rum, cloth, and cigar. Farmers, rum, cloth, cigars. Sweet. And that is, um, oh shit. I think I put that on the wrong one. Oh, no, I didn't. Okay. Scouts. Oh, wait a second. Scouts, tools, rum, and tobacco. I think I got these on the wrong ones. Forty-seven, twenty-seven. Yeah, I, I did. I did put them on the wrong one. Disadvantage of having two of these guys shuffling around. King can only ask tax stuff that you have in your port cities. If there's nothing he can put tax on, it'll automatically apply on something. But if you keep one small amount of something you don't care about, he surely will tax that. Huh. I thought tax was really. Have, isn't tax for trading? I thought. Huh. Interesting. Maybe you're right. Maybe you're right. We'll see how that goes. We'll see how that goes. Because if it is coastal towns, then you're right. I mean, I might as well just put it one town over, and then I can just have a wagon train carry stuff over when I need to uh, carry it to the port town and then ship it away. Okay. I need $2,000. So, uh, yeah, I don't really get the tax events. I, I know they come up and he increases the tax, but I always thought that was just a... Um, I always thought that was just a, a fee for selling stuff to... Um, or buying stuff from Europe. I'm, I'm, I'm probably wrong with that, aren't I? Okay, let's... Actually, no. Let's chart that down real quick. 33, 32. 32. Huh, interesting. Um, cargo, unit, colonist skills, buildings. Huh. Yeah, I, I definitely need to learn more about how tax works in this then. Yeah, well, no, I know the prices will go up and down with them. That's, uh, you know, that's a pretty, pretty solid mechanic of the game. Uh, 4326. 4326? Yeah, okay. 43, 26. Oh, looks like I just found another European up there. French and Dutch have signed a peace treaty. Four miners, rum, cloth, and cigar. Four miners... Rum Claw Cigars. Thank you, Mr. Cherokees. Um, ore miners, tools, tobacco, and coats. Tools, tobacco, tobacco, and coats. You don't need to learn it. You can play without that knowledge. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. Um, there's... Well, honestly... Um, you coming along has kind of inspired me to learn more about this game. I've, I've played a lot of it, and I've mastered some of the systems that I'm, I'm familiar with, but there's a lot of depth that I probably need to know a little bit better. No doubt. And one of them, you know, you obviously just mentioned one of them, the, the whole taxation dealing. I don't really know how that works or what it affects. Oh no, I'm glad you're here. I'm, I'm certainly glad you're here. Uh, again, I, 
I, I wouldn't have joined that Discord had I not been, you know? So, definitely glad for your help. No doubt. Um, blacksmith shop. Oh, that's right. Nice. So now we got our tool production going. Now we need a... We need an expert pioneer is what we need. So what are we going to build here? Wag Have we not built a wagon train yet? Oh, well, that's what the other town is building, isn't it? Let's go ahead and build a dock so we can populate the sea area. Yeah, exactly. So, let's... I've already gotten this guy, right? 38, 32... 38. Oh no, I haven't gotten that one, have I? 38, 32, double check in here. No, looks like I missed that guy. Okay, well that's next. 38, 32. It also tells me if I've explored them or not, which is which is really helpful because um, going to a place twice sucks, you know? Okay, let's explore over here. Thank you, Cherokee. Okay. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. And I've tried to, at first, uh, before I started actually writing them down, I'd work in kind of like a crescent pattern. You know, I'd go uh, back and forth to the west, you know, north north and south, and then westerly in, in my exploring them. That way I'd keep from kind of going to the same place twice. But it still happened, and it still pissed me off every time it did. Um, what do we got here? I guess it really doesn't fucking matter, does it? Well, let's just keep going. Oh, nice. Plymouth finally got their wagon train. So let's throw this guy back down as a lumberjack. We got another lumberjack coming, so that'll help. And then a warehouse, because, oh my god, these guys are about to fill up. Okay, ore miners, cloth, rum, tools. Ore miners, cloth, rum, tools. I've now explored 18 different cities. Okay. Noise. So what did that make there? Oh, it, 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 oh, I thought I put an oasis there now. I guess I'm wrong about that. Okay. So now we got our wagon train here. Let's um Let's go ahead and just make a trade route right now so I don't have to worry about it. Let's see, create a trade route, Jamestown, land route, Triangle, Plymouth. Okay, and that's really easy. Um, actually, we decided that Plymouth was going to be our main town, so let's uh, sugar, tobacco, cotton, fur. Of course, the big thing is, is ores needs to be there. And... Um, Okay, here we load everything, except for ore. Oh, wait a second, I forgot. Uh, silver, right? Oh, yeah, okay. Cotton, fur, no ore, but silver. And then Plymouth, we unload. Oh, no, we load ore. There we go. And then we'll just take him and... Uh, in trade route. Um, no, I, uh, actually I did. I plowed over, uh, north of town, which was a desert, and it turned it into an oasis, so this, this oasis here wasn't there when I started this town. This one up here, I, I plowed that, and it, um, and it did that. Yeah, yeah, for sure. I'm, I'm almost positive that oasis wasn't there when I started. As a matter of fact, when I started this town, I was really apprehensive because I didn't think I'd have enough of a food supply because there was a desert here, desert here, you know, the mountains and hills, and then just this one little forested area and one fisher area, so I was really worried about it. But 
Nope, the second I plowed this one out, it went from three food production to eight. Can I gather fur on it? I don't know. Fur trapper, zero. So no, I can't get gather fur on that oasis. Um, these guys are building docks. I guess that's fine. A new cargo of sugar. Shit, I'm going to need to do something with that. I guess I could process it. Yeah, let's go ahead and process that for now. Um, I guess this will... I, I'll need a master distiller. I guess that's what I'll do in this town is, is distill and stuff. But... Uh, it kind of makes a disadvantage of not uh, doing the um, coastal town, though. I'm going to need another wagon really soon. Okay, should I go here? Yeah, let's head to this place here. 33, 32. Okay, ore miners, rum, cloth, cigars. Ore miners, rum, cloth, cigars. Done and done. Okay. Um, we can plow that another time, can't we? Let's plow it. Okay, Jamestown. Actually, I'm going to change that to a wagon train. I can use another wagon train to start hauling stuff that I need to sell. And I'll, I'll basically just fortify those on uh, Plymouth. Okay. Nice. Oh shit, that's another, that's another boat. <laughs> no problem. Thanks for showing up, man. Um, you're uh, always welcome, of course. Uh, I need to view Europe, and, um, yeah, have a, have a great rest of your day, or, oh, you're lurking great. And I'm gonna purchase me a privateer. Hell yeah, dude, another ship will help. Get these guys to land as quick as I can. Okay, where am I gonna send this dude? Send him here. 38.46. It'll take him a while to get there, but... I should be exploring in that direction anyway, because that's uh, closer to where I should be. Okay. There's my wagon train. We haven't explored this one, have we? 3832? Oh yeah, no we have. But I didn't get this stupid uh, secret thing there. having two ships now. I need to start building uh, soldiers too. Lord knows that's going to bite me in the ass. Eventually it's going to come up and somebody's going to declare war with me. A okay, fur trader. I don't really have a fur-based town yet, so we need to kind of work on that. Let's, um... Maybe have a good spot for one. Of course not. That's crap. Everything's near the goddamn Aztecs. Or near somebody. About right there. That way we can get silver out of it. Or up here. We Oh yeah, let's do up here. Boink. There we go. And I can add that to the trade route. Let's see. This guy's going to need food soon, but I'm going to send that to my second town. Because that needs to grow. 
Nice. Okay, so we got a lumberjack there already. We don't need it. Let's go ahead and send him to the second town too. Um, ooh, let's pioneer this guy up. Got plenty of tools going here. Okay. What do we have to trade? Nothing? Um, but we still do have guys in Europe, don't we? Yeah, let's send one more boat back to Europe. Got that guy right. 38, 32. Yeah, okay. Okay, let's get some road going towards Plymouth. Since I got another guy over here. Hmm. That guy's producing rum, but not doing a very good job. We need a rum distiller next time we can afford it in Europe. So let's... Hmm. Yeah, I don't care if I lose that eight unit. Eight units, I don't, I'll leave it there, whatever. Okay, road there. Um, don't care. Y'all next. That's thirty-eight twenty-six. Still paying for land, unfortunately. Okay, ore miners, tool, rum, coats. Ore miners, tools, rum, coats. Thank you. You give me money. Okay. So let's lumberjack this guy up. Then we can take this guy. Farm him up. Noise. That means we can put a whole shitload of people here now. And these guys are going to be producing rum, so we need an expert rum guy. A rum distiller. Wow, these guys are really uh, on the ball with tools. I need more food production and I need another ore miner here. Okay, let's go ahead and do the docks. Next, we'll probably do a schoolhouse. Once we get everything built that we need there... Oh, wait a second, that's tools, so we'll probably leave my lumberjack and everything there because we'll need to build artillery. Who's this guy? 3327? Is that right? 33? Okay, that's right. And this is going to be our fur trading guy. That's exactly what I had in mind. As much as I'd like you to trade furs right now, guy, you need to build stuff. First thing needs to be a warehouse. Also, we need to edit this trade route now. We need it to go back to Jamestown. And actually, this is backwards. Um, shit. Yeah, let's delete that one. We need it to go to Roanoke and then Plymouth, because Plymouth is going to be our hub. So, Roanoke, we're going to load everything up, but um, fur, because that's going to be our fur place. Or and silver. And we're going to load... Um, oh, wait a second. No, that's wrong. That's wrong. Roanoke, we're going to load sugar. 
tobacco, cotton, ore, silver, and break. This is going to be a short break here. This is Thorn with the Game Design Lexicon. We're currently playing Sid Meier's Colonization, uh, making trade routes and, and, and colonizing stuff. Um... Yeah, our band for the day is Quiet Riot. If you like our content, make sure you give us a follow here on Twitch, uh, or we air these over on YouTube after the fact if you want to watch anything that we've already aired. <laughs> 